everyone, welcome to my channel. Today I am going to be unboxing the Ipsy for November 2018. Um, Ipsy is a $10 a month subscription with five sample size items in it. They also have the Ipsy Glam Bag Plus, which I unboxed the other day, did a Ipsy Plus versus BoxyCharm. So if you wanna see that, I will leave the link down below. Um, but this is just the $10 a month subscription, so let me go ahead and pull it out. Um, this is the bag this month. So it's purple with black hearts. The zipper thing is just gold and it says Ipsy on it. So let's go ahead and see inside. So the lining inside is pink. And when you open it up, it says, Happy Friendsgiving. Say what you're thankful for in five emojis and go. So um, kind of just a cute little conversation. And then um, this month we're feeling hashtag blessed for so many reasons, like pumpkin spice lattes, besties, besties, puppies, and pizza. Most of all, we're thankful for our awesome ipsters like you. So here's a few perks to make your month even more glam. Um, they're just talking about their cashback program, which I, I get enough makeup and subscription boxes that I don't buy a whole lot on my own. So without further ado, let's go ahead and get inside my bag. The first thing I am pulling out is an eyeshader brush by Bogachis. Don't know if I said that right. That it is there. Um, this is probably, um, oops, let's see if it'll, um, it's probably a good brush for like in the, to get your inner quarter or to smudge under your eye. So I love getting brushes. That always makes the value of the bag seem more worth it. Then I'm pulling out from Ciate London. This is a translucent powder. This is a very tiny sample. It is 1.5 grams. So that's what it looks like there. There's a little bow on the top. And then there are, there's a protective film, but there are five holes on top. Oops, won't focus, but it is, um, I'm glad that there are five holes. I've gotten another one from like Laura Mercier before, like a sample size, maybe in a, for a play, and it had three holes and the powder just wouldn't come out. So I just couldn't end up using it. So hopefully that will turn out well. Then from Sand and Sky, I have a sample size of the Australian Pink Clay Pore Refining Face Mask. Oops. I'm really excited for that. Um, I love doing pore refining face masks. I have oily skin, so this is perfect for my skin type. Then from MAC, that's a Prep and Prime um, Natural Radiance Base Illuminizer. That's six milliliters. And it is radiant yellow. Um, but the cream, you probably can't really see it, but it doesn't look too terribly yellow, so I think it should be fine. Um, I'm very picky with primers, so we'll see if I like this. I know I've used other MAC ones before that are just okay, but I, I, again, I'm very picky because of my oily skin. I need a primer that's gonna really keep my foundation on all day. Um, the last thing I'm th seeing is from Nomad, and this is Stockholm Midnight Sun. Um, smooth, blendable highlighter with fine champagne pearls infused with blackcurrant ex extract. I don't remember, I know I looked on my profile, I don't remember this being one of the items, but I guess it was. Um, let's see if I can get the box open. I'm struggling a little bit right now. Well, I guess I'll just rip it, because that's kind of, there we go. All right, so it's just a cute little um, thing there. When you open it up, it is the world's tiniest highlighter. When I put my hand behind it, it makes it worse because I'm so pale. Um, so excited to, I guess, try that out. So I don't really have highlighters selected in my profile. Um, so let me go based on my profile what I would like. So I like this. I like the brush. I like the powder. So for my ranking system, basically, I give a point if I will like and use the product. No points if I'm just not going to use the product or it's not right for me. And then I give a half a point if uh, maybe I'll use it sometimes or I'm not that excited about the product. So each of these three get a point. So that's three points. This um, is a half a point. I probably won't really ever use this. So three and a half points. Same with this. That gives that makes the, it a four out of five Ipsy bag for me. I'm gonna probably use this when I travel. Same with this, just because it's really little. Uh, but other than that, let me know what did you get in your Ipsy bag this month if you get one, or what did you like in my bag? If you're into unboxing videos or subscription boxes, go ahead and subscribe. I'm subscribed to all different kinds of boxes: a ton of makeup boxes and beauty boxes, skincare boxes, bath boxes, stationery boxes. Uh, home decor boxes, food boxes, all of that. So if you're into that, go ahead and subscribe. If you like the video, go ahead and give it a thumbs up and I'll see you in my next video.